Let's add a color-coded status to Excel in one minute. We're going to start by inserting a column here and we're gonna call it approval status. Then let's add our statuses at the bottom. You can put this on another tab or turn it white, but it's gonna be approved and not approved for the sample. And then we need to go to data validation and choose list. We want those two options to be our only options that can be chosen. You can add more as needed and let's drag that down. Next, for the color coding, we need to select everything and go to Conditional Formatting, New Rule. And for each status you have, you just repeat this step. So for the first one, we're going to say equals dollar sign D2, because that's the start of our status, equals approved in double quotes. We want to turn anything approved green. Hit OK. And now we need to repeat the step, like I mentioned. Do it again. This time, it's going to be the same formula, but in double quotes, it's not approved. So make sure we type that in exactly as it is on our spreadsheet. And then for this one, you could go with like an orange or a red. Let's go with a bright red so it really highlights it. Hit OK. OK. Test it out. If you're approving something like a timesheet, like we are in our example, you could always try on the clock to automate this type of work. 